Hey, what is up Credit Movement community? It's Ryan. Today's Daily Credit Minute. I just wanted to do a quick follow-up because a lot of people have been coming into the community and sending private messages or commenting on previous videos and particular it's been with the authorized user thing and people have been saying things like, hey, adding someone with poor credit to a credit card sounds like a terrible idea, things like that. The truth is, you guys, it doesn't matter. The only person that can benefit or be hurt by being added as an authorized user is the person being added. So again, you guys, just if you have a child or you have a, a friend or a neighbor or relative and you're thinking about adding them as an authorized user, they don't need to get a copy of the credit card. They're just basically piggybacking on your good payment history on that individual card. I hope that helps, I hope it makes sense. Um, thank you guys for all the, the love and support. Continue to, uh, to follow our page, uh, share our posts, and uh, keep coming back for more.